that's something. I mean, they could just wash their hands in the shower then. Um, it's about the only way I see this working out. I don't know that World Adventures does have does have wallpaper and flooring, which is good. I mean, like the wallpaper itself <laughs> mightn't be good for the actually I dig it, um, but at least it exists. Just what matters, right? Oh shit, I forgot about the light. Um Oh god damn it. That's like unselected again. Uh we'll just have to go with the first thing we see. Okay, I'm not sure if that's really where I was to go with. But hey how that it is. <laughs> Hopefully people are gonna find the way back in now after the DC's over. store items or screw you. I'm not looking to spend my money on you. You've already got so much from me. Okay, bedroom. I kind of just want to leave the fireplace. To be honest. What's the bedroom gonna be? Generations. Oh, we've not had generations so far. So it's definitely new. Let's see, do you have wallpaper generations? Please don't let me down. Don't let me, don't let me, don't let me down. Oh, that's generations. <gasps> oh my god, there's wallpaper! Okay, that's pool wallpaper if ever I did see one. And that's just fucking intense. Why is all of this so intense? Like, what the hell? Can there not be anything normal? Hmm. I guess this is like the most normal I can do. But at that point I might as well go all grim and edgy. Sure where the flooring just disappears on me like that. It is a miracle to me. Uh, hello again. Yeah, I think view account just kind of dies when, when stream does. You know. I think that's where that comes from. The tent comes with generations? Really? What? Doesn't make sense. Okay, I mean, if this is an expansion pack where we have bunk beds, then I think I've got to go for- wait, no, no, I, w I want actual bunk beds where there's like a second bunk. Or we just make space for like three children here. Slap a desk under this. Because I am sure, being The Sims 3, unlike the fucking Sims 4, this probably works. I can't really attach a chair to it though, so maybe it doesn't work. Hmm. Maybe it doesn't. Oh man. Can 
I put like anything on any of these walls? Jesus. There you go, unicorn, dragon, a knight. Some children toys. That chemistry laboratory from The Sims 4 that everybody's so sick of, really? And a cane. Wait, why, why not at this point, honestly? Let's have the bookshelf block out the light. Knowledge is more important than anything, children. Um. Okay, so this seems to be like the only hanging light. Okay, and I definitely do, do want to go in and modify that. Give them like different ones, right? Because that blue does look super bland, and I don't, I don't really appreciate that. Sure, why not? Why not a fabric? Um, like this one. There you go. I, I'm not sure this looks good, but there it is. Mirror above the fireplace? Nope, nope, there's no bloody space for it. Who could have thought? Ugh. Okay, so there is this sort of thing. Just put it in front of the window, I guess, whatever. I mean, sorry, the painting. Uh, why not? <laughs> That's an interesting clock. And then, I mean, I guess as a little nod to the tent existing, I can just like put the tent in here somewhere. And then, like, pretend they take it out for camping. Like that. Um. So, Zaku, what was your what was your plan? Because I disconnected just as you were talking about the Valentine's plan with playing Lee. How, how, how's that work? Um. Oh my god, what is this? It's a whole science lab! Okay, so this then classifies as an office. Okay. Um... Six. No, no, not more Katy Perry sweet treats. Two. Fast lane stuff, really. Yeah, I was just wondering what your Valentine's Day plan was because uh, I disconnected as you were saying that. Okay, this is probably like all we're getting. Well, I guess we at least have uh, we at least have space to put this up. So this is like, cause just beware all ye who enter. This is just this man's workspace. 
newly refined. Well, I don't feel like that belongs in the house, but we'll leave it there for good measure for now. Sure, why not? Oh, we don't have Valentine here. Yeah, I was just asking about what your what you said the Valentine's plan for stream and league would be. Okay, um, we'll just disable that really quickly. I mean, that's not gonna fit in here. Yeah, if anything, I'd have to put that outside. Well, I mean, I can just do that, because why not? And then we can have, like, Oh, this is for the ship, so. Like, we can play pretend. Let's say that. Wait, do you need a full parking slot? No way. They, they actually do. That is unfortunate. Also, this looks bloody ugly. Like, I mean, I much prefer that sort of thing. Oh my god, what are these racing cars? Like, that one looks cool. That one looks like it's from, like, Back to the Future or something. Like this? Well, I mean, this is... I guess I just kind of like the old Thames a lot better. Yeah, I like that as well. Fun fact, I was in possession of a VW Beetle for a short while. Like, a VW Beetle with um, an open top as well. So hella fucking cool. Um, so yeah, I guess we, we've now placed that down, so that's that's something that happened. Um, you meant playing League in general, what will people have? Gifting some shitty red hearts. You, you got something against Valentine's? You, you seem a little bit you seem a little bit aggressive, man. Um, but yeah, I do definitely like this being like... Um... A sort of repair station for these. Okay, and this is kind of another living room. I think I've placed too many things is why things get so laggy now. Oh yeah, Earth, uh, please remind me to write down that things are getting super laggy in The Sims 3 now. Um, because that's definitely something I want to write down before, but... Because of the PC's problems. Um, five. Island Paradise. The living room, okay. Thank you very much. I mean, I know that creator style makes it laggy as well. But I don't feel like it's that right now. Sure, we can just go for that. Oh my god, it's so dark and brooding, though. I'm not sure I like this. <laughs> oh, right. Only that horrendously big plant. Actually, they're both horrendously big. But yeah, I mean, I've actually got an exam on Valentine's, so I won't be doing much one way or another. Um, what objects are you intersecting there? Is that the doorway? Ugh. That light is so bad. What the fuck? 
How could you live with that? Like, look. I don't get it, man. I just don't get it. need to play so many so as it's not like all shadowy everywhere and I think that that's just dumb to be entirely honest with you and again I've got like nothing to put on the walls hmm. well then um that would be my island paradise roof. Good nothing against them, but I can just type that without me noticing. Uh huh. Yeah, that seems perfectly natural. Um. Actually, I guess it would be a bit more cozy if I did it like this. Nothing about this is going to become cozy, is it? This is just fucking horrendous. Um, can I slap some outdoor activity in here? Oh my god, that's massive. Yes, that would make so much sense. Sure, let's just plop a plant down in front of the house. Um, outdoor activities, anything? A tent? Just like modular stairs. Come on. Don't be like that. Must be outside. Okay, that does make sense to be fair. Okay. I think I think this horrendous adventure <laughs> is coming to an end here. So I mean, to be fair, honestly, the fast lane room here looks so much better than a lot of the other stuff. It's, uh, it's kind of embarrassing for the other stuff, isn't it? Should we just, should we just make a little YouTube video out of this too? Oh, for you down. Um, just like, get this part of the stream from here on out where I go over the rooms and how the challenge turned out and everything. Would you be down for that? Um, also, I feel like I should delete this hot tub. Oh, right, then I just threw these out. Can't delete, oh, right. My bad. It must be outside. Okay. It's the garage. Don't make such a fuss. Oh my god, it's getting laggy. I mean, like, sure, there's a couple of items, but calm down. Just remind me. Alright. Okay, so. This then is. Oh my god, it's bad. Okay, so, welcome, YouTube, to this little summary video of how, what I did on stream, which is using a random number gen uh, generator to go over all of the Sims packs I own, excluding town life stuff, because what did, heh, I don't, I don't know what the point of that one is. And um, doing a each um, each room is a different pack challenge there, and I was not very consistent with it, and I had to re-roll sometimes because, like, especially for the kitchen, I kept getting packs where there were like just no counters in it, and it was horrible. And oh my god, I got Katy Perry sweet treats so many times, it was horrible. 
I, I, everything is horrible here. Um, <laughs> so we're here in um, the supernatural world, exactly. And um, so here, because of fast lane stuff, I put a, put a couple of cars out. Um, then, so this, oh no, sorry, this is not, not the, not the spooky world anymore, no, this is actually the university world, because my sim enrolled at uni. And then I realised, oh damn, I'm only renting this place. Um, so yes, so the garden became a little bit wild, because of Katy Perry sweet treats, so I did the porch, and the garden with Katy Perry sweet treats and hello with that lovely lady. Oh, I love how the clothes are actually outside there as well. That's cool. Your feet are a little bit low res though. Um, this is not Katy Perry sweet treats. This is something else. I just saw it and I was like, okay, yeah, yeah, I'm going with that. Um, so you can relax here. Aren't you supposed to be able to play in the sand? Okay, so that's already weird. So then we've got the swing. She can't go with the slide, lovely. We've got we've got the Katy Perry bike. And we've got this water water slide, I guess you would call it. Just just slide like a million times. That's fine. Do you have a cut on your arm? Oh sorry, that's a tattoo. Ah uh, yeah. Ah uh, hmm. Well then. <laughs> I thought you had a cut on your arm and I was like, that's not in this game. Wow, you really didn't enjoy that, did you? <laughs> Just like some, like immediately stops. All right, so this woman is a bit of a bodybuilder, as you might be able to see. <laughs> I like how she just stops completely. Well, where are you going? Go to university meeting. I'm filming a video here. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> okay. Um. You're riding on your broom. I bought you a car for a hundred and ten grand, you mad woman. Okay, we're just we're just gonna continue filming without my sim. That's that's fine. That's fine. Oh, I didn't. Oh, I wish I could go in there. Um. Okay, yeah. So this this was already pre-built. I just modified it and like took the the existing floor plan uh, to work with. So, the garage, I didn't, I made the, the upstairs unusable because I didn't need it. And then I just put my car in here. Um, which, which I wish my, um, my sim would actually use. That would be, that would be lovely. Um, so should we go, I kind of like the top floor the best in a way. You can you can already look inside and see that it's fucking chaos. Katy Perry sweet treats there, Anubis statues there. Um, oh, that 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 one's a bad one. And then just a lady there. Um, so oh oh oops. oh my god, that's so weird. How that tree just stays there. What the hell? <laughs> okay, so when you walk in, you first go into the dining. Well, living room, more likely. So yes, I did just plop down everything I could find, I will be honest. Oh, oh that's very much a fish islands. Um, and wait, I think she's... Oh, did you just fall? Why didn't you get into your swimsuit? Now you're just gonna do it without your sw <laughs> Change your clothes, you weirdo! We'll say these. Oh, now you're gonna change your clothes afterwards. <laughs> oh my god, the Sims! I swear to God, these water slides are like one of the the, the only reason I I've ever wanted Sims for backyard stuff because it's got them, and I'm like, oh, I miss my water slide that somebody threw away at some point. Actually, I think we cut it to pieces, as well. Um, so so that happened to mine. Um, but but yeah. Anyway, um, so living room. Uh, can I just get you to like be here when I'm showing these things? So we have like all sorts of things on the wall, like this random sword, like these, like these men. Can I set the color of the flames? All lights. Okay, but 
Oh, but my PC is absolutely dying with the Sims 4, uh, Sims 3 here. It's a bit bad. You're feeling lonely. Right. I'm glad my video is boring enough to you that you just start snoring with your eyes half open. It's, 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 it's great. Um, so yeah, I used everything from World Adventures that didn't completely stick with the Egyptian theme, and this was just from creator style. Um, I don't know. I kind of liked it at the start, but now I'm not so sure anymore. And then prepare for the absolutely horrendous dining room, which um, I got Island Paradise for, and these are the only dining tables and chairs I got from that pack. There was like one other one, but I figured we might as well just embrace the fast food restaurant vibes at that point. So that very much is just a bunch of plants, then some seating there, and then just this cheap plastic stuff, which... I don't know. I, I can't say I'm too fond of it. Um, and then... What do you mean no interactions available? Is it because she's asleep? Does this thing just not work anyway? Is that a thing? And then here, we've got the Into the Future... Um... Um, the Into the Future kitchen, which is um, very, very easy to recognise, I would say. Just by being super bland, super boring, <laughs> kind of futuristic, I guess. Though it just seems very minimalistic to me. Do you just burn yourself making that coffee? I hope you didn't. Um, so yeah, not much to say about this one. But here we can see the plastic chair in action. It's, it's great, isn't it? You, f you feeling good, woman? Luck says it all, honestly. Um, <laughs> um, so yeah. Yes, yes. Uh, let me just speed you up right there so I can see you synthesizing those cookies. There you go. It's as easy as that. Okay, just grab a plate. You got this. All she needs is social. And here we enter the super na- I swear to god, it looks like she's just dirty. It doesn't look like that's a tattoo. Here we enter the supernatural dining room with two bars. I did kind of keep a lot of the original concepts that this house had. And when there was no paneling for the for the specific pack, I just kind of left the old ones. And yeah, I mean works well with what was here already. Um, but yeah, and then here we've got this one I didn't yet see the felters on, so this was supposed to be late night? Or was it showtime? They both are literally the same to me. Um but yeah. The, 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 the top is from somewhere else, so this is this is just inaccurate. Also brilliant that this towel is a is a thing in a, in a private room, to be honest to me. Um okay. So then up the stairs we go. Um, we find ourselves in this, um, I think this is also showtime, um, hall, which actually with the panelling and everything, it looks legit, um, like, um, that way. this is not going well for me, um, like, I think this is just perfect, like, it just fits, like, I mean, obviously I could have done better with these, but let's just watch it for a second. Um, but yeah, very fond of that. So, then here, I got Showtime with the bathroom, and here I was actually consistent with it. I just didn't have anything, so I didn't put anything in. Then here we've got another supernatural bedroom, and this one's actually like a big romantic one. Uh, because this is where Bella and Edward Cullen um, sleep. So here we've got... Oh my god, what the fuck? Um, could you calm down? Painting? Uh, <laughs> it didn't look like that when I put it up. So this is where Edward sleeps, with this old portrait of Bella, who doesn't always look like this. And then here's Bella's bed with... her picture of Edward. Um, who used to look a little bit better, but I guess the two have, have just seen better days. 
at this point. I mean, the book came out a while ago, right? Like, what do you expect? Can you interact with this? Oh, you can. That's pretty cool. Put on graduation robes, but you're so far away from that. You haven't even attended a single class. Oh, well. Um, and then here is a bedroom. I think you can tell which pack I got here. It's, uh... It's Rihanna Sweet... Ah, uh, no, sorry. Katy Perry Sweet Treats. And... I now know. It's just so intense. And, like, all of the super alpha imagery that is just, like, blatantly put into the game. I don't know. I do like this. And then, um... I do really love the guitar as well. To be honest. Um, like... But I think the guitar is just brilliant. Um, but the other things, not so much. That's nice how you can have your graduation robes the day you signed up to uni. You can tell the robes are much higher res than the guitar though. But yeah, love the guitar design. I would actually love to have this in The Sims 4. If there's any modders who ever see this, please, that guitar, yes, please. Uh, <laughs> but yeah. All oh, right, that's the TV being super loud and annoying. Okay, so, and here we have another World Adventures bathroom, which I then kind of gave up on and made it a season's bathroom when I realized that World Adventures only had the small little toilet and the laundry. And then I was just like, okay, I need another thing. And then Ambitions just offered itself. Could, could, you, could you be done flushing, please? Um, so yeah, take extreme shower until extremely clean. Why does it need to be so extreme though? That's what I'd like to know. Um, could it be that The Sims 3 had routing issues with platforms? <laughs> I, I, to be honest, I didn't even know that was, um... You sing a lot better here than, than earlier. Um, but yeah. And then here we have a generations bedroom, so naturally I had to use the bunk beds as much as possible. Um, can I, can you go to sleep there? I wonder. And then you should light the fire as well. Um, you can actually just go up there, no problem. Nice. Because in The Sims 4, putting a desk below that, I would completely break it. Or at least in my experience with The Sims 4. Um, so yeah. And then we've got this little chemistry set here as well that everybody hates in The Sims 4. Um, and then I guess you can put that in your own inventory, or, or not. Um, <laughs> and yeah, I love this clock, to be honest. I've, I don't know why I have generations, like, I just really don't care for family gameplay at all. Um, but that, apparently I do have that pack, so th there's that. I'm hoping that if I have all the lights lit up and, like, the fireplace lit as well, that maybe a fire will break out. Um, I don't know why I'm hoping for that, but I am very much hoping for that. Just, just don't burn to death, okay? Uh, because I want to get, I want to get done with showcasing this. Oh, you get a whole. That's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. There's so much to do in The Sims Three. Sims Four, but sadly never. Um, but yes, so what have we been through? We've been through these, this, this, this. So, just one left. So this used to be, like, um, a library office space. Um, which I completely changed up. Because I got ambitions. So I just plopped the desk down, then, did, like, the interior designer thing. And then a bunch of couches, probably too many, then a workbench. Um, and yeah, not much more to say about this room. I like how it turns out, it turned out as a bit of an office space. Um, then, going up. 
Uh, here we have an island paradise um, living room. And oh my god, it's so empty and so sad. <laughs> like, I just had no furniture to work with. So, not my brightest moment, I'll tell you that. Like, if, if I would actu actually actively play in this house, I would definitely have to renovate this part. Um, and then here, one of one of the things I'm proudest of, because this is kind of a little bit more innovative, is um, using the fast lane stuff to have a garage or like a workspace, much like you'd usually have in a garage, up on the roof. Um, or like right under the roof, I mean. And yeah, um, pretty happy about this. Um, way it turned out. Like, just having all the tools and the signs and then here, it's like, beware, you're entering a danger zone. Um, and then, like, I mean, this thing would never be up here, but oh well. And then I figured you'd just have these two, the, the spike and this scooter, I guess it is, um, here just as, like, something the, the person's currently repairing, whoever works here. So, yeah, pretty fond of that. And then, um, I did change the paneling on the side a little bit to match the inside room to go with the paneling I had for the specific room. Doesn't make any sense. Looks horrendous, but it looks a bit more like what I would do in The Sims, right? So it's a bit more personalized right there. Um, you're feeling tired? Well, we've got plenty of beds. You can just go to sleep soon then. Um, but yeah. That is essentially everything I've got for you. Um, this also applies to the current stream, to be honest, um, <laughs> because you know I've uh, I've completed what I came here to do now. Um, so yeah, uh, I've never seen this animation either. Um, but yeah, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this small summary of the the absolute mess I've made. Um, it's it's not good by any means whatsoever. But hey, it's it's what I usually do when I play any Sims games. So yay. Um <laughs> that's uh that's the thought of today to reflect on. Oh 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 is that should have somebody have supervised the fireplace? Yep, somebody should have. Alright, how about how about you extinguish those? You're complaining about not having sleep. Okay, then call the firefighters. Oh my god, the entire house has got burnt down. Um Okay. Do you have to stand here and watch? She's happy? Don't come that close. Okay, 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 run out, run out, run out. Run out! Oh my god, just leave the house! Get into water! No, don't set the colour! Wait, can't you get in? Oh, it's because there's a fire in the house. No, 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 just, just run out! Just run out! Don't die! Don't die! Don't die! Like, let the fire people do it! Let the fire people do it! They're here for a reason, alright? I also kind of want to see them in action, to be honest. Oh my god! <laughs> it's spreading fast! Generations, you're burning down. Alright, alright, don't burn to death, dude. You got this. Is it just one man? Just one single little firefighter? Oh my god. What if he burns to death? Will I get a replacement? You're in your pajamas! No, have a water balloon fight. With, th with that man? Just get out before you die. He can handle it on his own. He doesn't need you. He's a professional. Oh my god. You're running right through the fire, you mad woman. And you love it. I keep telling her not to because I just... Because I just want the house to run down, kind of. Because it's, it's that bad, right? But still. Um... <laughs> Oh man.
And before I just sent her to sleep here. Oh, 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 he's out of there. He's Balaam. Oh, but the fire's still on, huh? You should poke the fire. You should play with the fire. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, so is he gone? You okay? Can I, can I like be nice to him? Ask about Major. He just saved your fucking house and life, or she apparently. And you're just gonna ask them about the Major? <laughs> your priorities are a bit strange. Imagine she just plays with the fire. <laughs> Another one breaks out. Oh man. But yeah, okay. So, um, I guess that was massive foreshadowing. Me saying that with, uh... Oh. Play with fire, you gonna get burned, woman. You gonna get burned. What are you doing? Serves you right for poking your fingers into a fire. <laughs> oh my god. It already looks like it's out of bounds again, to be honest. Um, but yeah, so th this was this was that a random, random pack build challenge that I kind of manipulated and didn't go through completely with. But hey ho, hey ho, it's fine. Um, and then she can just go to sleep and relax after that after that adventure. Uh, thanks for watching. All right, and then you can end the YouTube video here. So that's from minute 18 to minute 42. Um, Jesus Christ. You okay? Uh, does the fireman said anything? Is on a da dangerous kick and just played with fire. Burning memory of the flame has been seared into her mind. She had a close call with the flames of fire. She won't ever forget the terror she, fe she felt when she felt the heat of the flame. Fire started at home. Melissa Bre Brendelhoff won't forget narrowly escaping with her life and saving a precious envelope collection from the flames, okay? Oh, she's skinny. Interesting. Hmm. Okay, um, but I do actually have to like stop the stream here as well anyways because um, Because I've got to walk the dog so that is a thing that is happening Let me just get rid of my morning rope already Finish your potion. Oh, Narose! Yes, you should definitely drink that 100%. Mm -hmm. uh, unsure. Actually, I'm not sure that fixes any of your problems. Oh, right. She's also desolate. Um, but yeah. Yeah, that was today's stream. Thank you very much for joining in. I'll see you again in another time. Bye bye. Have a lovely evening, morning, afternoon, wherever you are. Farewell.